This is Callahan's and Mrs. Robertson's class wonder project. In the third grade, we learned how to write a, an informational text for this project. We used the stripling model of inquiry to guide us. After picking a non-fiction topic, we connected and brainstormed our background knowledge, which is the first step. I chose Taylor Swift for my topic because I really like her music. Also, we thought about how to best organize our information into different chapters and studied mentor text, text to get ideas of different text features we could use in how to elaborate our writing. The second step was to create driving questions. Even though we knew a lot about our topic, there were still things we wondered about, like... My topic was surfing, and I knew how to get up and do all the motions and stuff, but I didn't know how to um, surf all by myself. Working on this project, we realized that writers are actually researchers to step three is where we begin to investigate the answers to those questions by using lots of resources like books, online encyclopedias, and a kid state, state search engine. Once we had all of the information we needed to construct a new understanding of our topic based on what we knew and learned, which is step four. We were finally at the point of sharing our work with other others, f step five, and we did that by creating our very own nonfiction books. We made sure our books include chapters, titles, captions, and other text features, just like a professional book you'd get from the library. My topic is soccer, and I'm most proud of my table of contents. Then, with step six, we reflected not only our work, but using, we, but how we work. Using self-assessments and, and checklists, we discovered if we go back and reverse, see some of, if we had to go back and reverse, see, and see some of the things we learned. Hi, my topic is Babe Ruth, and I learned that he was such a troublemaker that he went to boarding school. I learned that the first six teams weren't called the original six because they were the first six teams. I learned that in football that Rob Gronkowski is 6'6". Six, six. Hi, my topic is dogs. I learned that dogs can do really cool tricks. See what we're most proud of. Hi, I'm most proud of my introduction. I'll read you the first um, sentence. Mommy, will you please push me is what you will not be saying when you read this book. You will be saying, um, Mom, I already know how to swing. I read a book about swing, swinging. Watch. Hi. Um, I, my topic is crystals, and I'm most proud of my drawings. And this is the, this is the, like, the cover of the, one of my drawings that I have drew. Hi, my talk is baseball, and I'm really proud of um, that I finished the book.
Hi, my topic is Wheelock School, and I'm most proud of my introduction. Here's the beginning. Did you know that Ralph Wheelock was the very first boy teacher? That's where Wheelock School came from. And I started my introduction off with, did you know? Most people did if you're, like, say you're going to do plenty party planning. They're going to say, if you're going to plan a party and stuff like that, but I thought I could do it that way. And um, that's why I am most proud of my introduction. Hi, my topic is the time that I beat my dad in basketball. And I'm most proud of my title because I told it is very colorful. Hi, my topic is video games and I'm most proud of my cover for how I drew it. Hope you enjoyed your presentation.